It is hardwired in the DNA of Filipinos. It's need to bid farewell to the old and welcome the new year with boom, bang, and bright flashes of light. And though it has been outlawed since the pandemic by a presidential decree against it, it has come back with a vengeance and sales are way up. Notwithstanding the four dozen injuries and the accidental death of a four-year-old tot, as Orion Lesigas reports. A few days before the new year, the health department recorded the first case of ingestion of the firecracker Watusi. The victim is a four-year-old boy from Calabarazon who accidentally swallowed the said firecracker inside their home. The OH says 13 more firework-related injuries were recorded as of today, bringing the total to 88. Three out of every 10 cases or 31 incidents coming from the National Capital Region or NCR. Among the 13 newly logged cases of FWRI, the DOH said that the victims are in the age range of 5 to 49 years old. Meanwhile, amid the expected increase in the prices of fireworks, buyers continue to flock to Bukawi, Bulacan. G, together with her family, bought dozens of fireworks. According to her, their New Year celebration won't be complete without fireworks. Ayoko naman kasing ano, ma New Year kami na New Year, tapos may mga, may mga tama or anything. Yun, yun lang. Yung safety kasi talaga number one for us. Kasi may mga bata. Tapos, I treat my kids as kids pa rin. All right. Yun lang din yun. Kasi mas masakit sa, pa sa parent na may sakit ng mga bata, tapos you welcoming the new year, may mga tama sa mata or anything. But for their safety, G makes sure not to buy illegal firecrackers. We assure, tapos we ask them kung paano i-operate para alam din namin on our side kung baga responsible buyer din kami. Mahirap din kasi lalo na pag parent ka, masakit yun sa'yo, masakit yun. Tapos parang pangit yung pasok ng New Year pag nasa hospital. Some vendors express disappointment to vendors who sell illegal firecrackers. Marami pong napapahamak sa mga illegal na paputok eh. Mm. Ang nangyayari po, sami po yung sisi. Malalaman niyo po yan kapag po may TS mark ang gada item. Mm. Nandito po yun. Mm. Pag po may ganyan, certified po yan na ito ay registrado. Interior and Local Government Secretary Benhur Abalos called on local government units to strictly enforce their respective ordinances that ban the use of harmful firecrackers. This is to ensure the safety of their communities and lessen if not totally eliminate pyrotechnics related injuries prior to and during the New Year's Eve celebrations. Based on DILG data, there were at least 1,210 LGUs that already have ordinances banning the use of harmful firecrackers in their respective localities. According to the Philippine National Police, the list of prohibited firecrackers include, among others, Five Star, Plapla, Piccolo, Goodbye Philippines, Goodbye Bading, and many more. Ryan Lisigas for the Nation.